Good morning, happy Veda day eight. It's August 8th. I love palindromes, don't you? Um, but today is a day that Nick and I are going to try the new cereals. And yes, I know they've been out for a while. Yes, I know we're late to the party, but this is going to be our foray into the new cereals and they look amazing and everybody's reviews have been wonderful. So I hope that we like them too. So by now, most everybody knows what these new cereals look like. This is the Mixed Berry Crunch and this one is the cinnamon brown sugar. And the packaging looks like this. And they're pretty hefty sized bags and it sounds like there's a lot in each one. And we've heard that they taste just as good dry as they do wet with some kind of unsweetened um, almond milk. So I purchased this one and there's been so much debate over which unsweetened almond milk is allowed and all of that. So I'll show you what the contents, what the ingredients are on mine, and you can decide for yourself if I've chosen a good one. Okay, these are the nutritional facts for the Almond Dream unsweetened almond milk. 50 calories, 3.5 fat, 135 milligrams of sodium, 3 carbs, less than 1 gram of fiber, and 1 gram of protein. Um, and this is for a one cup serving. So I thought each one of us would try one of the flavors. I think I'm gonna go for Mixed Berry Crunch if that's okay. I definitely want the cinnamon and brown sugar. Okay, cool. Sure. So we'll try them dry and then we'll try them with the almond milk. And cool. we'll see if we like them, yeah? All right, I'm ready. Okay, I'm going to have the cinnamon brown sugar cereal crunch. So I will pour it into my bowl. Oh, wow. How many you think are in there? Oops. About 200? Get it all in there. Gotta get my nutrition Ooh. there. Should we count them? <laughs> I don't know that I want to count them. Uh, but there are, I mean, it's a decent size. It's not too bad. Um, so now, to try the dry version. Mmm. That is really good. That is really good. Sweet. Nice texture, crunchy. I like it. Totally tastes like cereal, which it is. Does mm -hmm. it taste like the um, the way the brown sugar cinnamon oatmeal tastes like? No, it's in different. a cereal form. It's or? different. This has more of a robust flavor. To me, the oatmeal, while they're good, they don't have like crazy pow flavor. This to me is like. Here's flavor, hello. Okay, so totally different than the I think Parmesan so. cheese puffs from yeah, yesterday. way different than the cheese puffs from yesterday. All right, well, can I try yours? Definitely. All right, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I'm going to pick this one right here. So once again, I like to compare things so you know the size. These are bigger than Cheerio, much bigger than a Cheerio, probably the size of like a... Uh, the size of an Apple Jack. I know I've heard people compare these, uh, this particular flavor to Apple Jacks, but I don't know. Do you think it tastes like Apple Jacks? No. Anyway, here goes. This is the cinnamon brown sugar cereal. Oh my God, it hits you. Mmm. You definitely get flavor. Nothing like the Parmesan cheese puffs from yesterday. Um, wow, sweet. Sweet. Um, Really sweet, but not like it grabs you back here and makes you salivate sweet. Um, the first flavor I got was maple. And then I get a cinnamon at the end. And oh my gosh, I could just sit there and eat them just like that for sure. I wonder what it'll now, be like with I the will milk. say after, because it's been a couple of minutes since I've had one, because you are trying it, I can taste kind of a little bit of an aftertaste. Um, that, like, non, that sugar substitute aftertaste that you might get if uh, I know for me personally like Diet Coke things like that I get that um, so I can kind of taste that because I've stopped eating it here um, but while eating it yeah it's very good okay I haven't had that weird aftertaste but then again I'm not as sensitive to that as he is um, but I'm gonna say first impression it hit me like wow so we're gonna try it with the milk now all right, so it's one cup of the unsweetened almond milk. Okay. A lot of milk. It is a lot. I mean, I would, I would imagine you don't have to do a full cup if you don't want to. To me, that's a lot of milk. That is a lot of milk, but there's a lot of cereal, too. 
Alright, let's see. Oh, the cereal to milk ratio is pretty good. It is pretty good. Right? It's pretty good. You're right. I don't know. I, I would probably start with maybe half or three quarter cup and see how that works. But you're right. It's a pretty good ratio. All right. So now to try with milk. All right. A mixture of cereal and milk. Mmm. The flavor is still good, but it brings a whole new dynamic to cereal because just like eating any cereal, it's totally different drinking it with milk. And to me, I like it better with milk because it makes it a little wet. And I like wet food. Uh, so I definitely prefer the flavor with the milk. But with that said, the cinnamon maple flavor, to me anyway, with the milk, isn't as strong because you've got the flavor of the milk then now kind of diluting or mixing with the actual flavor of the cereal. It's a great compliment. I'm not going to say it's bad. It's just different than eating it um, just plain without the milk, just dry. Right. Okay. Um, well, it's still very good. I would definitely order it again. Awesome. Well, try it now that it's been sitting there for about a minute and a half. Try it again. Did it get soggy? No. Still crunchy. I can hear it. So do you feel like that would stand up to, you know, a 10 minute, 15 minute eating a bowl of cereal without it turning into mush? I think so. I mean, you can kind of tell it's getting a little soggy, but it still maintains the crunch. I mean, you can see, I can feel it with the spoon getting a little soggy, but honestly, I don't think it's bad. All right. It looks delicious. All right. I'm gonna... I would definitely do this again. I like it. It's a great breakfast, I think. All right. Great. I'm going to try the uh, berry one now. Excellent. Okay, guys, it's time for the mixed berry cereal crunch, and just like the other one, it smells good, um, and it looks pretty good. It's uh, let's try it out. So same thing goes for this one. It's bigger than a Cheerio, probably the size of an Apple Jack or a Fruit Loop. Um, oh man, I don't know which one I like better, Nick. Oh yeah. I'm not gonna say anything. Oh my god. Oh my god, it just punches you in the mouth with uh, berry and fruity, but I wouldn't, you know what, people have said Fruit Loops and I kind of had my expectations set to Fruit Loops um, with that disgustingly, sickeningly sweet. This kind of has a slight, um, it's like if, if Fruit Loops was done in a healthy version, um, you know, less less sugary, less you know, disgusting, diabetic coma, sugary, sweet, but definitely good flavor. Oh my gosh, that's, ah, why didn't we buy more than one box each? Those are so good. Okay, well, I'm thrilled with it dry. All right, Nick, hold on a second. Let's see what right, you So say. the fruit, uh, the fruity cereal, dry, let's see. Wow, that is fruity. Now, with that said, <laughs> I'm not a fruity cereal kind of guy. I've never been. So if I had a choice between the two, I would definitely take the cinnamon um, because just me, I don't care for fruit. But you can definitely taste it. You're absolutely right. I mean, it just hits you. The fruit flavor, the berry. Yeah, it's definitely, if you like fruit, I would recommend it. Okay, here goes. So that's a pretty decent quantity of cereal. I mean, that's not any slouch of a bowl worth. That's a lot. All right, so I'm going to pour in my milk, too. Okay, I have my cup of my Almond Dream unsweetened rice milk. Or, sorry, almond milk. And... That looks so good. It looks like a bowl of cereal, guys. I mean, I know it's a bowl of cereal, but haven't done this in a while, haven't like pushed a spoon around a bowl of cereal in a while. Okay, so let's get some good fruit to loop ratio here and give it a try. Mmm, look at that little drop of milk just about to fall off the spoon. You know you want to try it. Doesn't that look great? Wow. I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. I have a new favorite. Oh my gosh, I can't decide if I like the cinnamon brown sugar better or this one, but 
Oh my gosh, my next food order is going to be jammed with these. Um, cer dry cereal to take on the go, take to the movie theater, of course, transfer it to a soundproof packaging because nobody wants to hear that in a movie theater, okay? So transfer it to a Ziploc baggie or something that won't make any noise. Um, but oh my gosh just to grab and go, just to have something, a, ch a chip-like texture in a sweet format. Ah, uh, fast you made my day. You totally made up for yesterday. Thank you so much for offering these two new cereals. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We needed this, and it just came right in the nick of time. I'm sure everybody is just praising these um, cereals, and so are we. So I can hear Nick eating his cereal. I'm going to eat mine now too. So have a great day, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow for Veda number nine. Bye-bye.